Missy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so it's time for a grocery haul. I'm not using the microphone, because everyone says the microphone is worse. I will fix this problem, just, just give me some give me some time. I'm going to fix my uh, sound audio problem soon. I don't know. My laptop used to be fine with audio, then all of a sudden it's just not, so... And every microphone I try doesn't work, so I think it's the computer. So, it's okay. I will fix it somehow. But, I gotta get to my groceries before they all melt. I'm doing this on Tuesday, October 13th. Yes? Yes? Thumb and share. And so, um, if you can't hear me, just put on some speakers. That's how I do, because I, I listen to videos that are low as well. And I put in extra speakers. Um, I plug them in and turn them on high, or I use the CC closed captioning, or just pretend it's one of those Amspar, you know, artery sensory videos. Anyway, I'm going to get on to it. It's like $88, I think, I spent at the grocery store at Vaughn's. Yeah, I think it was like 88 and something. Oh, 82, 83, 82, less than I thought. So I'm going to get right into it. I got a six pack of um, my Andre Brute. Uh, I wasn't going to get that much, but I'm like, you know what? I'm going to get a six pack. It is 30% off, so it saves me money. So I'm just going to go ahead and stock up. I do have other champagne people buy me, but I never open it. I don't like the champagne you have to open. I don't like those expensive champagnes. So I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I got champagne that I'm not even going to use. I like my Andre, not only because it's cheap, and it's what I'm used to, and expensive champagne gets me drunk quicker because it's higher alcohol content, I think. But also, I don't want to open that, those champagne bottles. I don't like opening those pop, pop. And they're too big for the refrigerator. So I like these. So I got a six pack of Andre. It's going to last me for a while. But there we go. Okay? Um, I got some cat litter. Might as well get the, the points out of the way. Got some cat litter for the kitty cats. All right. I didn't really get much, but let me have like a little mimosa. A champagne with a pineapple juice and just like a little squeeze of the tangerine flavor drops. I got, um, you know, I, I like the Stacy's pita chips, but these are cheaper, so I'm going to try these. These are just, uh, well, just generic pita chips. So I just got some of those because I did get into my Stacy's pita chips um, earlier in the week. And so, there's love. They're so crunchy and so good. So I got some more. Now, this I didn't get at Vons. I got this. I had to do uh, laundry today for people. And there's this little liquor store there. And i seen this. It's like $4. Never seen it's, it's, it's coffee, spiked cold brew coffee, and it's spiked with alcohol. It has like 12%. And then so I go, what kind of alcohol in it? And it says like a, like a tequila, like a agave plant. I don't know. I don't know when I'm going to be brave enough to try this. It was like four bucks. Is this an experiment? I don't think I'm going to like it, but this is going to be an experiment. I'm going to try this out one of these days. Anyone knows, put in the comments if you like that. So it's like, it's like, it's, it's like a tequila coffee. Do you put tequila in coffee? Is that like a, that's not an Irish coffee. Irish coffee is, um, Irish coffee is, is whiskey. So what is tequila in coffee? I never heard of it, but anyway. Got my birds, some more broccoli slaw. We love that stuff. So I'm going to put this in the refrigerator box right away so it doesn't get bad. And Ron's was out of everything because I guess it was like uh, Indigenous Day yesterday. Um, American Indian Day. Um, sorry, Columbus, you're out. You were terrible, horrid, horrible person. We should have never uh, recognized you. You were just lost. Uh, but um, it was Indigenous Day. People Day yesterday, so it was a holiday. So I think everything was off the shelf, so they haven't uh, restocked yet. I usually like to get 
those romaine hearts and they're big stocky ones because lately I've been eating wraps and they're so good because you can wrap up stuff in that. But they were out of them, so I was very disappointed. But I just got a couple of romaine salads, so I got that. Because I've been eating lettuce like crazy. And I've been eating wraps like crazy. So I just got two things of flour tortillas. One's going to go in the freezer, one's going to go in the refrigerator. Those are all the receipts. And then, since I'm there, I'm always going to get more cheese because you never know. I just got medium cheddar. Uh, this is um, rustic cut. This is kind of good. I like that. And I got on the pita chips, and then that made me think, God, I wish I had some um, hummus. <laughs> so I got some hummus because I didn't have hummus. I'm just going to put this in the freezer and wait till I'm ready to eat some. I got some classic hummus. That way I could uh, I could put whatever flavoring I want into it. Or if Larry comes over, he could eat it because he can't have spicy stuff. And then I got a uh, pine nut hummus. I like that too. So I got those two hummuses. And I I usually like um, going to Rite Aid and getting um, the vegan salami. Um but Tobruggi has this peppered one. I think I tried this before. I wasn't a fan of it. I like the other one that Rite Aid has. But pepper, I just, because this is what I've been doing. It's like, I just can't, I haven't got sick of it yet. I haven't got sick of it yet. Bread or tortilla, you put um, your plant-based meat, your plant-based cheese, um, some Miracle Whip, which is not plant-based, but if I can find a, a plant-based Miracle Whip, I might do that. Um, and then you put a bunch of red onion, and you put a little bit of uh, red pepper, like uh, powdered red pepper, like cayenne pepper, and you just wrap it up in a tortilla, or or put it on, on buttered toast. This is good, and I put a lot of lettuce in it, a lot of lettuce, so it really fills you up. That's my new thing. I haven't got sick of it. Okay, they finally got their uh, creamers in. They have snickerdoodle. I almost got snickerdoodle, but I already got uh, the cinnamon in there. And with these creamers, you have to put in the refrigerator, so I have limited space in the refrigerator. If it's there next week, I'll get the snickerdoodle. But I finally got my pumpkin spice. Finally got it. So I got my pumpkin spice in there. And then I got a big thing of salsa because I use that for I use this. I put this almost on everything. I'm a condiment girl, if you notice, like, my food is all surrounded by the condiments, like, salsa, salad dressing, uh, the hummus, uh, Miracle Whip, like, it's all about condiments, barbecue sauce, um, ketchup, mustard, like, last night I had a veg vegetarian corn dog dipped in honey mustard dressing, all about condiments, everything in the refrigerator is all condiments, it's all stuff to jizz up whatever you're cooking. It's nothing main course. Nothing main course about my 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 kitchen. Nothing main course. It's all about the sides. It's all about the sides. Okay, I'm getting low on butter, so I got like just um well it's, it's not real butter, but it's buttery um spread. I didn't get the can't believe it's not butter this time I just got this one. So I got some more butter got another red onion because I'm addicted. I love red onion. Everything. Like, I can eat so much of red onion, it'll make my tummy hurt. And I have done that. And it makes me stink. Like, my breath is really bad. But I love red onion so much. I got more red onion. And I did get a little thing of sour cream. I do have the squishy, squishy kind. I almost got it again, but I'm like, okay, I'm going to get a tub this time in case I want to make a dip. Because I keep, you know how I do chopped ramen, but I don't use the ramen mix. I have so many of these little chopped ramen thingies. Uh, well, I wouldn't use this because it's chicken flavor. This must have been my roommate's. But, um, like the chili lime and all that, or any any of these little chopped ramen mixes, I'll put them in sour cream and make like a dip. You know? I've done it. You put anything in it, it makes a dip. So that is it. That's $88. Not much, huh? 
or eighty-two dollars. Oh my god, eighty-two dollars. So not much. Just give you the bare necessities. The bare necessities. Oh well, it's really hot. It's a heat wave. When I'm done with this, I might go for a swim because it's that hot. So I'm going to hurry up and put everything this away because my roommate is away, but he comes back today. So I want to put everything away so I'm out of his hair when he gets back from wherever he's at. And um, and i got to put away the laundry as well. So to all my Stace Cadets and all my Burkettes, I hope you have a great day. Until next time, peace.